I support my clients regardless of what it is. Love, business, career change. There's a lot of women out there that when they really get in touch with who they are, they really want to know how to create what it is that they feel they have to give back to others. So I was asked, how do you save your transcript? I never knew this myself. I had to research this. So I'm going to make it easy for you. If you're doing a Zoom call and it's recorded and you want to save the transcript for whatever reason, I save my transcripts so that I can review over the highlights and remember everything that was discussed. So I'm going to share my screen and show you how you do that. Recently, I recorded something for my YouTube, for my clients, and I recorded it. So what we do is we go to your Zoom, where your recording is. So when you're on your Zoom, you record and you record to the cloud, not to your computer. And then what happens is it is saved in Zoom. And so you can see here, there's the recording. I can watch the highlights. And here is the audio transcript that I can download. Now, when you download this, it's really important that you go to the download and save it and allow it to be saved as text. Now, once you've actually saved that transcript, you can go through and you can read it, see what was said and where do you need to answer, give more information and so on. This is a very, very handy tool, especially as a coach. We don't want to forget what it is that people have said or what we have said to them. And I don't know about you, but for me, I do not like when I am not focused on my client. If I'm on a call, on a Zoom call, my passion is in person. So if I'm on here talking with my client, the last thing I want to do is be looking down, taking notes, reading the notes, trying to go back to them. So this is the benefit of recording a session, whether it's a meeting, an interview, doesn't really matter what it is. When you record it to the cloud, you will get a transcript. And the other thing is that you can also click where I was in my Zoom. You can click on there and you can share it. So it will give you a link that you can then send to your client so they can review. Sometimes when I'm working with my clients, we get so deep in the moment. We're really focusing on what they've said, what tools they can use, how we can go a little bit deeper. And so for me, I don't want to miss anything, but they don't want to miss anything. So sending them the recording allows them to stop and start. And then your recording of your one-on-one -on -one session becomes a valuable tool for them to revisit helpful for them though to make sure they download it quickly when you send them the link there will be a password and by them downloading it quickly when you go into your library when you've finished what you're doing auditing it really making sure you've got everything so that you're providing what you want to your clients then you delete it because it takes up storage space so anytime you send it to a client and they may not view it straight away or they want to revisit the video, just mention it's important for them to download it into their computer. I really hope that this was helpful. I love putting these together. I've got a number in here. I've got one on smart goals. I've got some on manifesting. I've got one on creating a vision board. I also have one on how to easy start taking selfie videos and how to edit them in Canva. And I love sharing this. So if there's anything in particular that you feel you need some extra help from somebody who is not the expert but has learned herself, 
in between the ages of 63 and 65, how to use technology and how to understand some of the features that are available to us. And some of these things took me ages to figure out. And I like to fast track it for anybody I'm working with. So I hope this was helpful. Put a comment below.